guys welcome to day three of the five days of healthy hair challenge so today is my hair oiling day now I actually wanted to kind of like stretch my hair washing day but today I decided that I'm going to oil my hair okay so this is what I'm going to be using all over my hair it's the Saint Tropicus coconut hot oil hair mask and as many of you know this is actually my go-to um, hair mask if I don't have time to make my DIYs. This one has biotin and it also has some hair superfoods. And on my scalp, I actually made another batch of ginger oil. So with this one, you actually have to heat this up. I'm going to go ahead and do that before using it onto my hair. All right, so I'm going to soak this in hot water for about, let's say 30 seconds. And then once it's heated up, I'm going to get it and use it on my hair. All right, so let's do this. I actually wanted to put a ring light here, but I'm like, you know what? I'm gonna be super casual with this and not even bother using my ring light because I think the light here is well, it's not that great, but you know. Let's keep this very chill, okay? So um, as I said, what I'm using is the ginger oil. So I'm gonna go ahead and put this on um, my scalp. I usually focus the ginger oil on these areas of my hair right here because this is the part where I really want to grow more baby hair. You know what, one thing that I've learned throughout the years of oiling my hair is to not over oil my hair because <laughs> before I would really like soak and drench my hair with oil that by the time that I'm supposed to wash it off it's actually very hard to wash off and I just end up using more shampoo than I should so just putting the right amount on your scalp and hair would be good you don't necessarily have to bathe in oil and I also know that some people their hair and their scalp cannot really handle that much oil so in return their hair usually falls out but for me I find that by just putting just the right amount of oil on your hair it's actually good enough already versus submerging your hair and scalp with oil and then after that as I've said I usually do a two minute or a three minute scalp massage I'm actually thinking of making a whole video on how to properly kind of like massage your hair for hair growth okay so now that's done I'm going to be using this coconut hot oil hair mask all over my hair all right, so I am just going to be pouring this all over my hair, just like that. And I really, really do like how this smells. It smells really nice. It actually smells like candy. <laughs> That's why I like using that. This whole pack actually really fits on my hair. I'm gonna massage all over my hair. To like distribute it properly. All right, so now that my hair is oiled, as I've said, it's just oil, but it's not soaking in oil. Like my hair is not dripping with oil here. I'm going to put my hair inside the plastic just, just to let it naturally heat up. I was thinking of like putting this really all over my head, but I'm like, you know what, today I'm not gonna do that. I'm just going to secure the bottom part and then just let my hair marinate there for a bit. All right, you guys, so now I'm going to be washing my hair. So this time I'm actually going to be using a clarifying shampoo just because I oiled my hair. Usually if I don't oil my hair and if I just do my regular DIYs, I don't use the clarifying shampoo. But since I let the oil marinate and really saturate on my hair, I will be using a little bit of the clarifying shampoo first before using one of my hair growth shampoos. All right, so what I'm going to be using is the Suave right here, Suave Daily Clarifying Shampoo. So I'm gonna get this thing off my hair. So I'm just gonna go ahead and um, wet my hair. And I'm gonna put that all over my scalp. And actually for this one, I will be using the clarifying shampoo all over my hair since as I've said, I oiled my hair. And this is just to prevent my hair from looking um, way down and oily because usually if I oil my hair and if I don't use a clarifying shampoo It does weigh down my hair. However, if I get rid of the excess oils My hair just feels moisturized, but at the same time it doesn't look greasy after okay So now I'm just gonna go ahead and rinse it off and then use my shampoo All right, so right now I will be using the Avalon organics and as I've said this has biotin complex and this is a Thickening shampoo, All right? Once again, 
And also with these types of shampoo, I don't really hesitate to use them just because as I said, those shampoos doesn't really contain any sulfate. Um, and at the same time, they have a lot of hair growth benefits. And I really do like the ingredients in the shampoo. And for this one, I usually just focus um, the shampoo this time on my scalp and not really all over my hair anymore. On the bottom part of my hair, I decided to just use one of my hair masks here, like one of my ready-made hair masks instead of using a conditioner. So the hair mask that I will be using is the one from Hair Fix. I think I've shown you guys this. And this is their Keratin Milk Repairing and Strengthening treatment. Okay, so I use that much. I'm gonna put that all over my hair. So I'm going to be leaving this on my hair for one minute and then I will rinse it off with water and that's it. All right, you guys, so I am currently um, drying out my hair right now. I am going to let it air dry since I have all the time in the world. I just finished doing my work and all that. So my hair is about 50% dry. I'm going to use this and this is called Redensil. It's an anti-hair loss serum. I, I've been using this on especially this part of my hair right here. So I think I'm going to be making um, a separate video about this concerning um, my hairline right here. Okay, so I take about just that much. What I do is I simply apply that onto my scalp, especially on these areas right here. And then I just massage it. And actually the cool thing about this is that it's not um, oil-based or anything. So even if you leave it on your scalp, it's not going to make your scalp oily at all and i'm actually just focusing it on just this area of my head so that is it for now you guys so tomorrow i will be showing you all the result of after i oiled my hair because it's the night time right now i'll see you guys tomorrow bye